Today's class, I am going to discuss about how to implement XNOR gate using POST transistor logic. Previous video, we discussed the implementation concept of XOR gate using POST transistor. If you need it, kindly refer the video now. We move on the session. So, first I draw the symbol of XNOR gate. So, it has a two input that namely called as A, B, output is F, the corresponding Boolean expression is A, X0, B, the elaborated expression A bar, B bar plus A, B. So, it is a elaborated Boolean expression for X0 gate. Now, I am going to write the truth table. So, in this logic gate, it has a two input A and B, output is F. These two variables making four combinations of input 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1. So, these two inputs are substituted with this expression, you will get the output. So, both the values are 0, 0, the x naught gate property is 1. Both the values are same, the output is 1. If any one input is different, the corresponding output is 0. So, it is a truth table. Now, I am going to implement this x naught gate using post transistor logic. x naught gate implementation using post transistor. So, here I need a two post transistor. We will get the output from here. So, F equal to A bar B bar plus A B. So, B bar B a, A bar. So, B is the control signal, A and A bar is the input signals. I just to substitute the value A and B from the truth table, we will find the result. So, case 1, when B equal to 0. So, when B equal to 0, just to verify the result. So, A equal to 0, F equal to 1. So, here A equal to 1, F equal to 0. So, in this case, F equal to complement of A. So, F equal to complement of A. So, F equal to A bar. So, A is 0, A bar equal to 1. A is 1, A bar equal to 0. So, the result F equal to A bar. So, B is 0. This transistor P1 is turn off, P2 is turn on. So, B equal to 0 means B bar equal to 1. So, this transistor is turn on. So, once turn on means this A bar value is copied to output F. So, F equal to A bar. So, it is a first case. Then case 2. When B equal to 1. So, when B equal to 1, A is copied to output. So, whatever value present in A, so this value is copied to output. F equal to A. So, F equal to A. I just substitute the value B here. So, B equal to 1. The post transistor 1 is turn off. Post transistor 2 is turn off. So, whatever value present in A, so this value is copied to F. So, this is the XOR gate, XNOR gate implementation using post transistor logic. I hope you understand the concept very well. If you are watching first time in my video, kindly subscribe and support us to make a lot of videos. Thanks for watching my channel. Thank you.